Our once great cities have become unlivable, unsanitary nightmares, surrendered to the homeless, the drug addicted, and the violent and dangerously deranged. We're making many suffer for the whims of a deeply unwell few, and they are unwell indeed. The homeless have no right to turn every park and sidewalk into a place for them to squat and do drugs. Americans should not have to step over piles of needles and waste as they walk down a street, a beautiful city, or at least once beautiful city, because they've changed so much over the last 10 years. Our first consideration should be the rights and safety of the hardworking, law-abiding citizens who make our society function. When I'm back in the White House, we will use every tool, lever, and authority to get the homeless off our streets. We want to take care of them, but they have to be off our streets. There is nothing compassionate about letting these individuals live in filth and squalor rather than getting them the help that they need. We need professionals to help them. For a small fraction of what we spend upon Ukraine, we could take care of every homeless veteran in America. Our veterans are being treated horribly. Likewise, with all of the money we will save by ending mass unskilled migration, we will have a huge dividend to address this crisis in our own country. Under my strategy, working with states, we will ban urban camping wherever possible. Violators of these bans will be arrested, but they will be given the option to accept treatment and services if they're willing to be rehabilitated. Many of them don't want that, but we'll give them the option. We will then open up large parcels of inexpensive land, bring in doctors, psychiatrists, social workers, and drug rehab specialists, and create 10 cities where the homeless can be relocated and their problems identified but we'll open up our cities again, make them livable, and make them beautiful. For those who are just temporarily down on their luck, we will work to help them quickly reintegrate into a normal life. For those who have addictions, substance abuse, and common mental health problems, we will get them into treatment. And for those who are severely mentally ill and deeply disturbed, we will bring them back to mental institutions where they belong with the goal of reintegrating them back into society once they are well enough to manage. It's a tough task, a very tough task, what's taken place on the streets, what's taken place with their taking so much drugs. But the fact is, we're going to try. This strategy will be far better and also far less expensive than spending vast sums of taxpayer money to house the homeless in luxury hotels without addressing their underlying issues, and they have so many of these underlying issues and needs. This is how I will end the scourge of homelessness and make our cities clean and safe and beautiful once again. We will do it. We will bring back America. Thank you.